and greetings. This is another great adventure of cycling with Brian Andrews Sr. and Shaka Zulu right here. You see him? Oh my goodness. Listen, this video is for a friend of mine who asked me a particular question. He said, brother, I love your videos, man. He said, you inspire me. He said, brother, but let me ask you something. Why do you wear those old school headbands around your head? Let me tell you something, brother. Oh, let me zip my jersey up because Mr. Nelson Vales told me not to. He said, let that zip that thing up. That's another video, another time, another story. But anyway, to answer your question, my friend, the reason why I wear these particular old school head uh, bands, sweat bands, number one, I have tried the gutter. It's a band that catches sweat and it's supposed to drip down on the side. I'm not advertised for these folks. I'm telling you why I wear this. I've also worn the halo. Both of those are okay if you're just playing around. When you grinding, you pounding, and you out here hitting that, uh, hitting this trail, you, you just into an endurance sport. Okay, the halo, sweat drips all over. It comes over and it gets into your eyes. And with the gutter, that product is okay too if you're not sweating profusely. But I sweat. You know what I'm saying? I perspire. So um, I need something that's absorbent. This right here, man, I never get sweat into my eyes. Now, if I'm sweating up here in the drip, that's a different thing. But I never get profuse uh, sweating in my eyes. Old school headbands work. Oh, my goodness. I'm trying to tell you. Nothing beats old school headbands for endurance sports. Okay, it's raining. July the 14th, 2018. The Tour de France is going on. Stage 8 was today. I haven't seen it yet. Don't tell me who won, because I'm going to go home and watch it. Okay, get off of that couch. Stop being a sour, lazy couch potato eating junk food. <laughs> I got to go. We'll see you.